grab his shoulder before I fall out on the rocks. I actually am pretty stiff. Half slide, just half slide. Just half slide, all the way. What we want to do is take balance out of the equation so our shoulders can be in the proper position. Come on, Kim, run on up and I'll run in behind these guys. Come on up, Lenny. I'm going to yell at these guys for a little bit and then move on to you. Yeah, we can take the center. Nice. What we're doing here is we're doing a little half slide work. It's going to be about three quarter slide usually. You do exactly what most people do on that. But what happens, we want to make sure we can get that knitting or that dancing with the hands taken care of a little bit and get, and get those shoulders back. Remember, chest out, chest out. I'm going to sneak up and grab these guys. I've already got Kim on a lot. right here. Yeah. Come on up. Okay, see? Now that we took balance out of the equation, you can see where you're at. You've got nice level hands. The blades are going in pretty much at the same time. Okay, now you can feel that your blades are going in together. Now I want to go ahead and go off the water just, just a little bit. Don't worry about the balance. If it falls, it falls. Nice. Good change. Excellent. Just go ahead and taxi it up just a little bit further working on that. We're going to move on to these guys. Linda, go ahead and hold up. And then the double. Down the limb, guys. Might be fun to watch. So, sl start slowly. The boat in, don't even, I mean, don't even break the legs. Just arms only for the first couple. Ready? Go. Oh, you can go with the feather. And recover on the water if you feel like it. I just want the reach. the same drill you would do in a sweep boat, but a lot harder. Now, I'll slowly start to extend it to get a half slide. Nice. You guys are ballast a enough well. Good enough. Don't worry about your line. Okay, now, let's go and see if we go to three quarter, but slow, slow and smooth. Recovering in the water is not a problem. If you guys are feeling comfortable, go ahead and take it up to full slide. Well, some level of comfort. Take, take five more, and then we're going to go back to the handles. One, two, four, five. Back to the grips, but still reaching out. Still reaching out. Feel that reach. Feel it. Let's go ahead and weigh it up. Well, actually, keep rolling, but get a little closer together, guys. Kind of meet in the middle. He's way back. Yeah, way back. Pass the start line. Ready? Rip. There. Oh. It's a lit. That's why we don't square. Find the ladies. We'll do the ladies and then we'll do the double again. And God, we're doing good. 
It's nice having controlled area. And these lines help keep it straight. Yeah. Well, they have a permanent line up at Bachman, oh, dividing yeah. the lake. down into the hills. Okay, that's good. Okay, nice and relaxed. Now make sure, wiggle your jaw. Wiggle your jaw, put on a nice relaxing smile. Now loosen those shoulders a little bit. Oh, give me a little wiggle. Give me a little wiggle. Come on, wiggle those shoulders. Nice. Now make sure, wiggle the fingers. Play the piano for me. See who can play the piano. Give me a wiggle, 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 wiggle. And last but not least, think about it and make sure your butt cheeks are not clenched. Relax your butt. Relax the butt. Relax the jaw, shoulders, and hands. really good but now we want to add because we want to make the boat go faster I just want you to add a touch of pressure with the legs just a touch not much not much and both of you guys go ahead and weigh it up okay let's go ahead and take off and if you swing to the middle I think I can get everybody pretty good Nice, Linda. Still watch that chin, see? Uh, now I kind of, you can see, kind of engaging just a little bit right there. A little, a little, kind of relax a little bit more, but we're near the end. digging deep a couple times to see what that's all about. Oh, a little deep. We can work on that. A little W rowing right there. A little deep and it shallows up. And David. It's a lot smoother, a lot more control than earlier. Looks like you're much more confident. Watch that dipping down now. It's like overcorrect. It looks like you're going to drop in your right side a little bit. It might be just my angle. But keep an eye that we're making sure we're symmetrical. Back to Kim. Good compression, yeah. A little late on the squares. Well, actually, that was okay. But we can make the catches more precise. We're gonna see some good catches uh, from Ben when he was rowing. He was doing a certain drill. We'll see if we can incorporate that this afternoon. Okay. circle back for the girls. Yeah, if we can just go right up beside side of 90 degrees, like in the other lane. Either way, I'd go to the left, because there's three people over there. Left or right, it doesn't matter.
right next to it. I want to catch this, the full side view so I can see where he's at. Crookley might be just doesn't fit in this quite well, and he was wondering. Wiggle your fingers, you got a little bit of a death grip going on and it's translating right through your arms. Even a little bit further forward so I can see the pin. There you go. You are getting a little bit too far through the pin. So you are pretty flexible. Okay, let's go ahead and weigh it up. Okay, now what you want to do is give me a little bit of shimmy with your shoulders. Just shake your shoulders on the recovery. Oh, come on, you can do it. Shake us. Oh, more than that. More. More. Do it twice more. And once more. And now just sit up in the boat. Go ahead, stop the shimmy and just nice row, nice and relaxed. Instantly better. Hand in hand. Good catches. Not bad. Good chain. Good chain. Good. That one was good. Still catching that starboard one a little bit early. Just a hair though. Not like it was this morning. Oh, that one was pretty bad. There you go. Nice job. Now. Okay, let's go. Now, legs are pretty solid. Looks like your right leg is a little bit longer than your left, but that's nothing we can deal with here. Uh, so they're moving a little bit like a sweep row. You see that little S they do right there? That's not causing that. Let's see the shoulders. Whoops. Shoulders actually are pretty solid and even. As a steering move, we're not gonna we're not gonna count that one. No, go ahead and 